What Darwin has said, what happened then? For 150 years, Darwinists committed fraud. They distorted scientific facts and deceived people because they would not be able to prove their claims by science. They have taken refuge in demagogy, propaganda and fraud. However, all their claims were eliminated by scientific evidence. Their forgery has been proved. What Darwin has said and what happened. Idaho hoax. What Darwin has said. 95% of its fossil remains are preserved intact, revealing that it is an utter lemur. Darwin has declared this to be the ancestor of man since it had bendable thumb and nails. What happened? It was understood that bendable thumb and nails were features peculiar to primates and that the fossil in question was an extinct lemur. Darwinist scientists described the depiction of this fossil as an evidence for the evolution of man as buffoonery, media circus, a source of shame, nonsense, and a stalemate for evolution. RD hoax. What Darwin has said. They said they discovered the most important upright walking ancestor of man. What happened? It is understood that in order to give the fragmented pelvis the appearance of an upright walking living being, it is joined together in a particular form. It became obvious that the fossil belongs to nothing but a bonobo ape. The Piltdown Man hoax. What Darwin has said. Darwin has said it was the greatest evidence of the imaginary evolution of man. It was displayed in British Museum for 40 years as the ancestor of man. What happened? Piltdown man turned out to be the greatest paleontological hoax in history. The hoax find consisted of fragments of a 500 year old orangutan jawbone mounted on a human skull of today. The teeth were rasped and the skull was worn out by potassium dichromate. The Nebraska Man Hoax What Darwin has said Darwin has claimed it was the imaginary ape ancestor of man and made illustrations of Nebraska Man and its entire family. What happened? It turned out to be that what they called the Nebraska Man consisted only of the tooth of a peccary an extinct animal similar to and closely related to pigs. Hesperopithecus, the Nebraska man dethroned. The coelacant deceit. What Darwin has said. Darwin has said it was an extinct transitional form from sea to land with lungs and feet that were about to form. What happened? Living coelacants are caught at various times in our day. What they called the lung was understood to be an oil sac while the so-called feet were fins. It was understood that it was a deep sea fish which could not survive in shallow waters. The Lucy Deceit What Darwin has said It was claimed to be one of the earliest so-called ape ancestors of man. What happened? The examinations on the fossil revealed that all its features, including its gait, were peculiar to chimpanzees, certifying that Lucy was a chimpanzee. Haeckel's False Embryonic Stages What Darwin has said Looking at Haeckel's drawings, Darwin has claimed that in the development stages of human in the mother's womb, there exists a so-called evolution from frog to human embryo and that a similar evolution is experienced among species. What happened? It was understood that Haeckel's embryo drawings were fake and that he deliberately displayed different living beings as embryo drawings as human embryo. Haeckel confessed his forgery as follows. After this compromising confession of forgery, I should be obliged to consider myself condemned and annihilated if I had not the consolation of seeing side by side with me in the prisoner's dock hundreds of fellow culprits, among them many of the most trusted observers and most esteemed biologists. 
The great majority of all the diagrams in the best biological textbooks, treatises, and journals would incur in the same degree the charge of forgery, for all of them are inexact, and are more or less doctored, schematized, and constructed. The Horse Series Myth What Darwin has said Darwin has claimed that 50 million years ago, horse of our day descended from a four-nailed living being the size of a fox. To verify this claim, they, in their own way, formed a sequence of extinct living beings that had by no means any interspecies connection. They formed the horse series by aligning short to tall living beings with decreasing nail numbers. What happened? Due to the recently uncovered fossils, the horse series were amended many times. At last, it appeared that horse series were a hoax made up of living beings, with different nail numbers dating back to different dates. With the discovery of a 47 million year old horse skull, the hoax was revealed. The Archaeopteryx Deceit What Darwin has said Darwinist claimed that Archaeopteryx is a transitional form from dinosaurs to birds, since the fossil has nails on its claws and teeth in its mouth. What happened? As science and many Darwinists confessed, it emerged that the Archaeopteryx is a bird with perfect flying abilities. Besides, perfect bird fossils that lived in the same period with Archaeopteryx are also uncovered. Launingornis and Confuciornis are perfect birds that lived in the same period with Archaeopteryx. The Myth of the Peppered Moths What Darwin has said Darwinists claimed that around the onset of the Industrial Revolution in England, the light-colored peppered moths on the barks of the trees that had darkened were hunted by birds that dark-colored peppered moths were selected by natural selection, which provides an evidence for evolution. What happened? When it became clear that during the daylight peppered moths never came out and settled on barks but hid in the unseen interior parts of the trees, some examinations were conducted. These examinations revealed that dark-colored peppered moths were placed on the tree barks by H.B.D. Kittlewell, a Darwinist biologist. The Homo forensis deceit. What Darwin has said. It was claimed that the bones uncovered in Indonesia belonged to a different type of human beings. What happened? It turned out that these remains belonged to a human being with microcephaly, a disease that causes small brain sizes. Forgeries of Neanderthals. What Darwin has said. Darwinists claimed that Neanderthals were a more primitive human race. What happened? It is proof today that Neanderthals were no different from human beings of today. They had the same life, intelligence, language and civilization. These were the kind of fraud Darwinists used to deceive the world. However, their entire claims have been refuted by scientific evidence and eliminated. Darwinists who can no longer deceive the world with fraud, demagogy and propaganda are in a desperate situation. The false religion of Darwinism is being erased from the face of the world. What is just will certainly triumph over the false. <laughs>